good medical morning. This is Watson with a topic that is a bit more intense than usual. Today we're going to talk about infections, carbuncles, and furuncles. So hold on to your seats, this is going to be a bumpy ride. Your discretion is advised. A skin abscess happens when pus collects in hair follicles, skin tissues, or under the skin. A furuncle, also known as a boil, is a painful infection that forms around a hair follicle and contains pus. By the way, YouTube age restricts, deletes, and sometimes suppresses videos on this topic. If this video is age restricted or has less than 100,000 views, pretty much guaranteed it was a result of YouTube's censorship. Furuncles develop rapidly as pink or red bumps. They're often painful. The surrounding skin is typically red, inflamed, and tender. Lesions often appear on the neck, breast, face, buttocks, or thighs. They occur in places prone to hair, sweat, and friction, and they tend to start in a hair follicle. The bump fills with pus within a few days, and it grows. The bigger it gets, the more painful it becomes. Furuncles may go away without any intervention. Sometimes they burst and heal without a scar within two days to three weeks. Carbuncle is less common than a furuncle or boil. It's a collection of boils on one site. It is larger than a single boil, measuring up to four inches across. A carbuncle usually has one or more openings that drain pus onto the skin. The most common cause of a carbuncle is a bacterium known as Staphylococcus aureus. The infection may lead to generalized body symptoms, including a fever of 104 point degrees Fahrenheit or higher, and a general feeling of being unwell, weak, and exhausted. So what's the cause? Staph bacteria live on the skin and inside the nose and throat. Usually the body's immune system keeps them under control, but sometimes they enter the skin through a hair follicle or through a cut or graze in the skin. When the skin becomes infected, the immune system responds by sending white blood cells to the affected area to destroy the bacteria. The result is a furuncle or carbuncle. And what should you do if you suspect that you have one of these conditions? See a doctor. It can be very complicated and hard to treat. Don't risk spreading the infection. See a medical professional today.